Welcome to QNE Software, a GST compliant accounting software for your company. In this video, I will talk on how to use IOXML to export and import tax invoices. Before we begin, please make sure your version of QNE accounting software is at least 2015.0.2.4. To learn on how to update to the latest version online, kindly visit the website below. This video is intended for companies that have multiple branches but do not prefer to be connected online. This means that the branches will input their tax invoice and export the tax invoice daily or weekly, then email to their head office to import the data. Or, for company that outsource their accounts to accounting firms, which means the company will export the tax invoices and the accounting firm will then import the tax invoices. Let's begin. Click on I.O. in the Navigation panel, then Serialization Configuration Group. Let's give a name for this configuration. I will put it as Tax Invoice. Click on New Record, select Serialization Configuration. In Type to Serialize, select Sales Invoices. Select Sales Invoice Code in the left-hand side panel. Make sure the key checkbox is ticked. The system will then return to the main screen of Serialization Configuration Group and the system will create other objects automatically. These objects have a relationship with sales invoices, for example, if there is a quotation issued and transferred to the sales invoices and new customers are created for this sales invoice, both quotation and new customers records will be exported and imported to the head office as well. Click on Save and Close. Now go to View, Navigation, Sales, Sales Invoices. Click on the Search button. Then, click the Date Filter and look for invoices that you wish to export. Hold the Shift key to select multiple records. Then right-click and select I.O. Export. The Serialization Configuration Group window will appear. Now select Tax Invoices and click OK. The system will prompt you to save the XML file. Now select a destination and give the file a name. Then click Save. This is how the XML file looks like. Now log in to the targeted database. Go to View, Navigation, Sales, Sales Invoices, then click on the Search button. Now select I.O., Import, and select the XML file to import. Now the records from the branch database is imported to the head office database. Thank you for watching. 